What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Boy Faction on TV. And tonight, I'll go to my WWE SmackDown review on highlights. So, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys please full watch the video before you connect with me the right way. Turn on post notifications to get notified when I premiere a brand new video or go live on YouTube Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday. Follow my social media, my Instagram, TikTok, and Twitch, and there's going to thread down below in the description. And let's get started. Now, SmackDown was a good show. And that's all I got to say. Now, SmackDown was live from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Okay, it says, WWE SmackDown kicks off with the Grayson Waller effect. They, this segment was just boring. With potted, potted plants, a desk, a chair, and a ring. Grayson Waller welcomes everyone to SmackDown. He says he's, he can't wait until Ash comes down later. Tonight to thank Grayson Waller by saying thank you for making me relevant again. <coughs> Excuse me. But enough about Edge. Let's talk about who will get the Grayson Waller rub. That and that is Santos Escobar in the new United States Champion Rey Mysterio. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Out comes the two superstars, and Escobar has a brace on his left leg. As they walk down to the ring. We see clips of Rey Mysterio winning the United States Championship last week after Escobar's Santos, Santos Escobar's injury. injury. <clears throat> Excuse me. Grayson Wild congratulates Rey Mysterio on winning the United States Championship. The fans chant 619 as Rey Mysterio thanks Grayson Waller. Rey Mysterio says <clears throat> Excuse me. Rey Mysterio says it feels great to once more be United States champion. Grayson Waller tells Santos Escobar he can imagine being champion. Ray says Austin Theory tired and tried to cook up a plan, and that was a plan that they <clears throat> ruined together. Grayson Waller tries to stir the pot by saying Ray is the champion. Okay. <clears throat> Ray tells Waller it doesn't matter who it, it who is champion. As the title is now with the LWO. <clears throat> Excuse me. Grayson Waller tells Ray he stole Escobar's chance last week. In which Ray tells him he stole nothing. Grayson Waller tells Santos he even beat Ray yet when it was Escobar's big night. <clears throat> Excuse me. It was Ray who stole his opportunity. This is what legends do. Ray is now ready to pass the torch. Escobar tells him to shut up in Spanish. <clears throat> Escobar calls calls Wale a dog and tells him to listen. He says the only person he is angry at is that low life, good for nothing. Austin Theory. <clears throat> Excuse me. He says he gave Ray his blessing because he respects Ray, something that Grace Wan does not have. Escobar calls Ray his friend and mentor. Okay. Escobar says he knows what Waller is trying to do, but it won't work. They, <clears throat> they are a family. He says Theory got what he deserved, and once he is full healed, and out comes Austin Theory to a loud, a loud boost from the crowd. <clears throat> Theory congratulates Ray Mysterio. <coughs> Excuse me. Theory congratulates Rey Mysterio on becoming a three-time United States champion. But where is the Father of the Year award? He wants to know who is running this show because he because what happened last week was a tragedy. He was played Theory get in the ring and tells Escobar that he wasn't man enough to step up to the greatest United States champion. <clears throat> Theory says he is the greatest, and Ray was not supposed to be in that match. And Adam Pierce is going to come out. <coughs> sorry. And Adam Pierce is going to come out, and him was rightfully his, and that is the United States champion. He says that he says that belongs to him, and he yells to Adam Pierce, telling him to come out. <clears throat> and out comes Adam Pierce. He tells Theory no one wants no one wants to hear him complain. LA Night Music hits. 
Okay, let me take another sip of my drink of water. A loud LA night chant from the crowd as he <clears throat> as he says, "Let me talk to you." He didn't just hear Austin Theory say he was the greatest United States champion of all time. If he recalls Theory, is the guy who defended his title once once every three months, and he fumbled the ball. <clears throat> LA Knight says he doesn't care who is the champion. Some sometime or another, he's coming to him. <clears throat> Um, he went through 24 other men at SummerSlam, and it won't be a problem to go through Theory. He says he he says he and Theory are dressed to fight. He sees Ray with the title, and he thinks of himself. What if what if it was for a a shot at the United States champion? Okay, Austin Theory against LA Knight. Pierce looks at LA Knight and makes the match. <clears throat> okay, so we get a commercial break. So we get Austin Theory versus L.A. Knight. In this match, this match was um, this this was a decent match. <clears throat> okay, as the bell ring, as the bell is about to ring, out comes the Miz. We already been through that, <clears throat> so yeah. The me- the bell rings. We are underway. Theory attacks L.A. Knight and stumps st- stumps on him in the corner. The Miz joins the commentary team. Theory with with a fall away slam. He slams L.A. Knight into the corner, but L.A. Knight comes right comes running back and hits him with a clothesline. <clears throat> Excuse me. A suplex by L.A. Knight followed by an elbow drop off the second rope. <clears throat> He goes for the cover, but Theory kicks out. Theory rolls to the outside as LA Knight follows him, but <clears throat> Theory slams LA Knight into the ring, into the ring apron. Theory grabs LA Knight, but LA Knight hits him with an elbow to the face. He slams Theory's face into an announcer table. He throws Theory back into the ring as as. As he and the Miz go face to face, Theory kicks LA Knight in the face, but LA Knight with right hands and he throws Theory into the Miz. Commercial break. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Back from commercial, Theory with a clothesline on LA Knight in the middle of the ring. Theory runs towards LA Knight, but. <clears throat> Excuse me. But LA Knight. Grabs him and slams him into onto the mat. Alley Knight repeatedly slams Theory into the turnbuckle and hits him with a neck breaker. <clears throat> okay. Okay. He goes for the cover, but Theory kicks out. Alley Knight stumps on Theory in the corner, <clears throat> and and with very with every stump, the fans chant, "Yeah, Alley Knight." Lifts Theory up, but Theory lands a hey, lands on his feet and hits LA Knight from behind. <clears throat> Excuse me. Theory goes for the A Town down, but LA Knight lands on his feet and hits Theory with a power slam. Um, <clears throat> Excuse me. LA Knight runs to the ropes, but Miz gets on the apron to gets on the apron that distracts LA Knight. <clears throat> Miz gets down. <clears throat> Excuse me. Miz gets down from the from the ring apron, and LA Knight turns around and hits Theory with a DDT. LA Knight chases the Miz outside of the ring. Miz gets in the ring, and LA Knight clotheslines him to the outside. Theory rolls LA Knight from behind and grabs the tights and gets the and gets the um and gets the pin. The winner of the match, Austin Theory. This was a decent match. Okay. <clears throat> so we get a video package. Eris of John Cena, Seamus Natalia, The Miz, Charlotte Flair, and Sami Zayn congratulating Edge on his 20, 25, year in w, 25 years in WWE. <clears throat> I'm a big fan of Edge. That's all I got to say. Commercial break. A video... <coughs> excuse me. A video package shows... Bret Hart on a TV show 
excuse me, with Edge in the audience, asking him question about becoming a wrestler. We see clips of Edge WWE career with Booker T, Paul Heyman, and more. WWE stars talk about him on uh, his twenty five on his twenty five years with the WWE. <clears throat> Damage control music hits, and out comes Bailey and Dakota Kai. Bailey says, even though the dumb, dumb, and Toronto are not worthy, and they, <clears throat> and they are going to grace them with a champion. They are not used to that either, but they will grace them with the new WWE champion, Il Sky. Out comes Il Sky for their tag team match. <clears throat> That's all I gotta say. I do want Dakota Kai break up. I want I want Dakota Kai to get away from Bailey, and that's all I gotta say. So we get a tag team match. Bailey and Io Sky coming by Dakota Kai versus Charlotte Flair and Bianca Belair. This tag team match. This was not a bad tag team match. That's all I gotta say. This was pretty good. Pretty good tag team match. The bell rings. We are underway. Bianca and Bailey start the match. Bianca with a waist slide takedown. Turn into a headlock. Bailey gets to her feet. And out comes and and out and out of and and out of but Bianca Bailey spears. Her into the corner. A snap soup a suplex by Bianca Belair and Charlotte Flair tags in. They double team Bailey in the corner. Charlotte Charlotte Flair stomps on Bailey in the corner. She's she slams her face first into the top turnbuckle. A chop to the chest by Flair. She goes for a suplex, but Bailey lands on her feet and slams Flair onto the mat. <clears throat> Eos Sky tags in. Eos Sky is tagging, and they double team Charlotte Flair. <clears throat> she goes for a chop, but Charlotte Flair kicks her away. Charlotte Flair with a splash in the corner, and she throws Eos Sky onto the ring apron. A big boot by Flair and Il Sky falls to the outside. Um, Flair on a ring apron and a cannonball onto Bailey and Il Sky on the outside of the ring. <clears throat> okay, so we go to commercial break. Okay, back from commercial. Flair with a backbreaker onto Bailey. Flair climbs to the top row, but Bailey with a right hand and she throws Flair onto the mat. Bailey goes for the cover, but Flair kicks out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Il Sky is tagged in, and they double team Flair. Il Sky with a crossface, but Flair gets out of it. Flair with a back body drop, and she tried to make the tag, but Il Sky knocks Bianca Belair off the ring apron. Il Sky with a chop to the chest. She throws Flair to the ropes, and Il Sky with a drop kick. She goes for the cover, but Flair kicks out. Il Sky grabs Flair, but Flair throws her onto the top rope. Bianca is tagged in, and she hits hits Il Sky with a t- shoulder tackle. Bianca, Bel- yeah, Bianca with a drop kick followed by a vertical suplex. She spears Il in the corner and hits her with a right hand. Bailey gets in the ring, and and Bianca with a backbreaker, a spine buster by Bianca. Onto Eel. Bianca with a moon saw onto Bailey. Eel with a drop kick to the back of Bianca's knee. She drives Bianca to the corner and tags Bailey back into the match. Bailey goes for the cover, but Bianca kicks out. Bailey grabs Bianca, but Bianca ki- kicks her away. Eel gets in the ring and du- in a double neck breaker by Bianca. She, <coughs> excuse me. She tags Flair back into the match. Flair with a crossbody off the top rope onto damage control. Flair with a chop to the chest onto both Bailey and Eo Sky. Flair with a fall away slam onto Bailey. Flair Flair with a clothesline. She goes for the cover. Yeah, she goes she goes for the cover. Um, but Bailey kicks out. Charlotte Flair climbs the top rope, but Bailey pushes her to the outside. Bailey distracts the referee as Eo stomps onto Flair on the outside. 
belly to the outside, and she throws Flair back into the ring. She goes for the cover, but Flair kicks out. Eel is tagged back in, and she goes for a moonsault. Flair moves Eel Sky and lands on her feet, and a right hand by Eel Sky. Flair in a corner. Eel goes for a spear. Um, Flair moves out of the way, and Bailey tag is tagging. Bailey goes for the figure figure eight, but Flair hits her with a right hand. Bianca is tagging, and Flair with a big boot onto Bailey. Bianca with the KOD. She goes for the cover and gets the pin. The winner of the match, Charlotte Flair and Bianca Belair. This was a pretty good tag team match right here. Kathy Kelly is backstage with Bianca. As she is asking her a question, Damage Control hit her from behind with a chair. <clears throat> they place Bianca's left leg in between a chair and slam a chair onto her leg. Bianca screams in pain as though the officials breaks it up. Okay, let's move on. So we get the Street Profits versus the OC. Um, this will say, uh, um, this will say solid tag team match. Okay. The bell rings and we are on the way. Gallows and Ford start the match and Gallows with right hands. He tags Anderson into the match and they double team him. Anderson goes for the goes goes for the cover, but Ford kicks out. Anderson runs to the ropes and Ford with a clothesline. Dawkins is tagging and they double team Anderson. Dawkins slams Anderson onto the mat and he hits Gallows with the right hand. Ford is tagging and Dawkins with a neck breaker. Ford with a frost splash off the top rope. He goes for the cover, but Gallows breaks it up. Okay. Gallows breaks it up. Dawkins throws Gallows to the outside. Dawkins is tagging. Anderson throws Dawkins shoulder first into the corner and he hits forward with a spine buster. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Gallows is tagging and they double team Dawkins. Gallows goes for the cover, but Dawkins kicks out. Anderson is tagging and they go for a match go for the match killer. <clears throat> Excuse me. But Dawkins kicks Gallows in the outside, or well, to the outside. Ford gets in the ring, and he fly, flies over the top rope onto Gallows, who is on the outside. Ford gets on the ring, <coughs> excuse me. Ford gets on the ring apron and is tagging. The Street Profits hit Anderson with a sit-down powerbomb netbreaker. Ford goes for the cover and gets the pin. The winner of the match, the Street Profits. This was a quick tattoo match. Okay. Bobby Lashley music hits and they celebrate on the ramp. Okay, let's move on. <clears throat> Excuse me. Commercial break. A video package showing last week's fighting between the Bloodline heirs. Okay. <clears throat> Paul Hammond is standing back is standing backstage and he looks worried and tired and tired. In comes Kayla. In comes Kayla, who asks for an update on the bloodline. Paul Hammond's Paul Hammond looks at her and says no. She asks him about Roman Reigns. He shakes his head. Okay. Let me take a sip of my water. She says she. She says she has heard a lot of rumors, and Hammond cuts her off and says he and says she is going to come to him about rumors. He asks about which rumor about Roman's cousin Jay Uso, the one who uh, abandoned WWE, who quit the Bloodline, who quit SmackDown and WWE. If he if she is going to ask him about his family, what about her family? He. He asks her, he asks how her mom is, if she has heard from her lately. <clears throat> Excuse me. He heard rumors. He heard rumors. He asked her about her dad and her cousin, but no, she didn't want to talk about the rumors of her cousin, but rumors about the cousin of the tribal chief. He says she won't even ask him about Edge in his 25 years. Or Austin Theory. <clears throat> His phone rings. And t he tells her 
as they say in Quebec, 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 which is a real province, unlike where they are, he has to take this. <clears throat> Excuse me. Paul Hammond speaks on the phone and says he is on live television doing an interview. <clears throat> Excuse me. He looks surprised and says, really, as they call ends. She asks him what they was about. What was that about? He says Jimmy Uso will be live on SmackDown next week. She asks him if he cares to share a source. Paul Heyman says he would love to, but even he would not dare as he walks away. Okay, commercial break. So we get the main event of the evening. Edge versus Sheamus. This was a good match. Edge got a huge ovation from the crowd. How come how come Tr how come Trish Rash cannot get this get the get a um ovation like Edge did? All you hear every time Trish Rash comes out, you get crickets. But when Edge came out, they the crowd was hype. This match was fantastic. With Edge already in the ring, Edge music hit it says, with Seamus is already in the ring, Edge music hits and the crowd goes crazy as he walks down. His wife Beth Fence and her and their daughters are at the attendance as he gets in the ring. Both men shake hands and the fans chant, Thank you, Edge. A headlock by Edge as he runs to the ropes and he and he knocks Seamus down with a shoulder tackle. Seamus gets back to his feet and hits a headlock. He hits a headlock by Seamus and he runs to the ropes, knocking Edge down with a shoulder tackle. Both both men smile as Edge gets back to his feet. Seamus to the ropes and Seamus with an Irish curse backbreaker. Commercial break. Back from commercial, Edge with a forearm to the face. He goes for the cover, but Seamus kicks out. Seamus runs towards Edge, but Edge throws him onto the ring apron. Edge to the outside. And he powers bombs Seamus off the ring apron onto the outside. He throws Seamus back into the ring. Edge throws Seamus back into the ring. And Edge climbs the top rope and lands a crossbody onto Seamus. He goes for the cover, but Seamus kicks out. Edge goes for the sharpshooter, but Seamus kicks him away. A slam by Seamus. He goes for the cover, but Edge kicks out. Edge rolls onto the ring apron and as Seamus grabs him. He goes for the 10 beats of the battering, but Edge blocks it. Edge with a right hand. Edge back in the ring, and Seamus rolls onto the ring apron. Edge spears Seamus onto the outside. So we go to commercial break. Seamus, back from commercial, Seamus has Edge in a Boston crowd, but Edge with right hands onto the back of the leg of Seamus. Edge gets Edge gets Seamus into the cross face, but Seamus reaches the ropes. Seamus climbs the top rope as Edge gets to his feet. A kid to the face by by Edge as he climbs to the top rope. Edge with a superplex off the top rope, and he hits Seamus with a execution. He goes for the cover, but Seamus kicks out. The fans chant, "You still got it!" As Edge makes his makes it to his feet, he climbs the top rope, but Seamus hits him. With the next breaker. Edge climbs the second rope and he gets Edge on, on his shoulders. Seamus with a white noise of the second rope. He lifts Edge up and hits him with a Celtic cross. He goes for the cover, but Edge kicks out. Edge Edge gets into the ring apron and Seamus with a Seamus with the ten beats of the battering. Seamus con continuously hits Edge hits Edge across the chest and Edge falls onto the ring apron and to the ring. Seamus grabs Edge and says he warned him but Edge slaps him in the face. As with the Edge as with your, I'm sorry as with a clothesline. Edge goes for the spear but Seamus hits him with the knee followed by the bro kick. He goes for the cover but Edge kicks out. The fans boo Seamus as he goes for a bro kick but Edge ducks Rolls Seamus up, but Seamus kicks out. Edge gets up and hits him with a spear. He goes for the cover, but Seamus kicks out. Edge with another spear. He goes for the cover and gets the pin. The winner of the match, Edge. This match was fantastic. And you know I, and you know that I was not going to miss this match because I'm going to remember this moment. But this was, this match was fantastic. Power goes off the air. Goes off the, 
Power goes off in the arena as Edge looks at Beth Phoenix and his daughters. Sheamus gets to his feet and they both and, and both hug both men hug as SmackDown goes off the air. But like I said it earlier, um yeah, like I said it earlier. Now um SmackDown I might as well say SmackDown was a good show. And that's all I gotta say, cause the show tonight was all about Edge. And that's all I gotta say. The show was good tonight. Alright, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys please for watch the video before you guys connect to connect to me the right way. And um Turn on post notifications to get notified when I premiere a brand new video or go live go live on Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday on YouTube. Follow my social media, my Instagram, TikTok, and Twitch, and Discord and Threads down below in the description. And I will go live on Twitch at 5 o'clock Eastern Time tomorrow. But um, thank you guys so much for coming to my live stream on YouTube yesterday. It was a W stream, man. Shout out to everybody that came to my live stream on YouTube. I had lots of fun, man. And that's all I got to say from here. But anyway, this will be with Faction on TV. Have a great night. Stay safe and always stay positive. Kept your crew, kept your kings, kept your club. Too sweet. And I'm out of here, gang. And I will see you guys tomorrow on Twitch at 5 o'clock Eastern Time. So make sure you guys come, in, come to my stream at... Come to my stream on Twitch at 5 o'clock Eastern Time. And let's have a good time while you guys watch me play AEW Fight Forever. And start get and I'm on that sub goal on Twitch. So start get the me subs on Twitch. And that's all I gotta say. But anyway, have a great night. Stay safe and always stay positive. Um kept your crew, kept your kings, kept your club. Too sweet. I'm out of here. Gang.